everyone. This is Patrice with Club Classics Revisited, and I'm back with another video. It's been a couple of days, missed you all, and I am back. And ooh, this gentleman right here, he popped up on my, in, um, I was going to say Instagram feed, no, YouTube feed, when I was doing some background stuff for this channel, and I went, ooh, ooh, I remember him. He was really, really popular in the late uh, 70s and early 80s. I don't know how much he's remembered today, but his name is Peter Brown. And he was born and raised in Illinois. Yeah. And started out, I believe, as a drummer. He is a, a, a singer. He's a songwriter. He's a record producer, and his biggest album was his debut, which came out in 1977, and the album's called A Fantasy Love Affair. It was actually um, released, I think, in 1978, officially, and it was a big album it went to number nine the album on the r&b chart and a uh, number 11 on the billboard 200 album chart it was very very popular the song i think i'm gonna play is his biggest chart hit um this song was really really popular when it came out um it was number eight on the Billboard Top 100, right? It was number five on the Soul Singles chart, which is kind of like, the, I call it the R&B chart. And then the Disco chart, it was number four. It was really, really popular. And it was the second single from the album. I love it. It's just a great song. A lot of people have reacted to this one. It's great. It's catchy. His songs are catchy. They're singable, danceable for sure. And this one is appropriately called Dance With Me.
Oh, yeah, that's a good one, isn't it? Oh, wow, I haven't heard that song in a long time either. That was Peter Brown from 1978 from his debut album, which was called A Fantasy Love Affair. And that classic was called Dance With Me. And, of course, he had another monster hit off of that album, Do You Want to Get Funky With Me? Do you want to? <laughs> Oh, I remember that one too. He will definitely be back on this channel. When I looked at his um, discography, I saw at least seven top 10 dance chart hits that he had. He was very popular back in the day. Yes, he was Mr. Peter Brown. Fact, on this record that I just played, among the background singers, the iconic Betty Wright. Yes, indeed. She was doing it, wasn't she? <laughs> As always, this is Patrice with Club Classics Revisited. If you like what you just saw and heard on this video, please don't forget to click the like button and subscribe. And also, don't forget that notification bell. I update weekly and if you hit that notification bell and subscribe, you won't miss a thing. I'll be back with some more of my favorite club classics.